Oh, uh, today is February third, Monday, and uh, I just got this AC to DC bridge rectifier uh, yesterday Sunday from Amazon. And I got have my wind turbine as you see can see hooked up to it. And I'm testing out the voltage. What's coming out of it? Right now the meter is not spinning right now. And I should get the voltage from right there. But so I might want to use this, hook this to my wind turbine and you know, let's test it out. Notice I disconnected the wires from this charge controller. It's a little funny thing, but it still works all right. As you can see, the three wires going in there, up there on top of the uh, charge controller. I got hooks of these clip cables going up to the bridge rectifier. As you can see, coming in right here. Where this is where the AC go in at from the wind turbine and the DC come out. All right, let's see how this goes. All right, the meters are peaking right now. Don't me the wind turbine have picked up some wind and produced electricity and going through the wires into this AC to DC bridge rectifier and the voltage is. Oh, 19 volts, I seen. Getting 20 volts, 19 volts. Oh, I'm getting some power. Now this is a uh, 24 volt uh, wind turbine. It's going through this nice switch from the, from the wire above and then coming out down here. And notice I got disconnected from this uh, charge controller right here. Going through these three clip wires up to the bridge rectifier from the back side, as I showing you earlier. And now getting 18, 15, and this many volts coming out of it right now. DC. As the uh, meters are peaking. All right, the meters are peaking again. Look at that. Oh, I see 30 something volts. <laughs> it's working. It's working. As you can see right now. <laughs> I might start using this bridge rectifier. Let's hook it up to my uh, wind turbine. Let that charge my batteries. I have to find a way to hook it and, and, and let it uh, stay hooked permanently to the batteries. Seems to be working pretty much all right though, this bridge rect rectifier, as you can see. I'm gonna start using it. Uh, Getting power from the grid and all that. This is something new I'm adding to this system. That's the diagram on it. And from Tice, as you can see, it's a 1600 volt bridge rectifier, 100 amp. It works, seems to be working great with my wind turbine, as you can see. All right. As you can see, it's my wind turbine. It's, it's turned around the best wind direction that's hitting from the front of it, as you can see here. And I'm bringing that power through the cable, as you can see. And oh yeah, I got these lines right here three lines as you can see to kind of stabilize the pole as the wind turbine spins because it shakes a little bit and now uh, you know as you can see it right here this is the ground 
connection just in case I get any lightning strikes. It get harnessed right into the ground right here. On this line, going all the way up to the wind turbine. picking right now oh man it's going all the way let's see how she does you know oh yeah look at it here we go one amp give it to me i'm talking about knows my meals are peaking as you can see Battery bank. It was 25.7. Now it's 25.8 right now. This bridge rectifier seems to be working all right. Let's see how she does. Oh, yeah, she's doing all right. I want the wind turbine is spinning and my measures are peaking. And when we get up to speed, then I'm going to check on the amps. All right, here's my wind turbine. It's spinning in the wind, man, look at that. And all this took up to that rectifier in the garage. I'm gonna see how much it's, it's generating and how many amps and how many volts it is. I saw it went going up to 40 something volts though. So let me go inside and see how much I'm producing from this thing on that rectifier, all right. All right, my wind to oh man, look at that. It's peaking. Let me get a reading from my bridge rectifier right quick as I touch it right here. Here yeah. Oh, I see that spot. 